Hello, Earth Signs. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Tisa. So great to have all of you here. We're here. We're now looking into January the, let's see, 20th and the 21st of 2024. And of course, everything that you need to know about me is all right down below. It's in our description box. Now, on my channel, I do go and find a secretive energy that's hidden, and I'll bring it to light here, and the mystery is solved here. So please enter here now at your own discretion and take what resonates in this message and leave the rest. Don't make something for here. It's not a story. Now, all the days this week right here, I have been using different decks. And then today I decided to use this deck right here. But I realized that this is the older deck right here. I've been using it for a while. And it has like a little bit of, you know, a little scruffs and things like that on the sides of the cards and things like that. But I'm still going to use it today because it's going to bring us a really good message, I'm sure. Okay, so anyway, let's go ahead and put this down right here. All right, Earth signs, Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo for the next 24 to 48 hours or so. Okay. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, January 20th, 21st is 2024, please, for... Earth, Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. So I feel like blinded no more. Fairness, fairness surrounds the situation now. Okay, yeah, because in the past maybe you was blinded about something, or in the past something could have happened in some way right here. Okay, with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius right here. Okay, now you could be thinking about the past or this person right here could be thinking about the per the past. So anything that's said here could be you or them. So just take it the way it resonates here, okay? But we're going to find a secret of energy that's here, okay? So let's see what's going on, okay? Earth signs right here towards Capricorn and Virgo. Okay, so the star card right here and a four of swords. So, you're definitely contemplating about this Aries from the past, Leo or Sagittarius, Aquarius right here from the past. And like I said already, it could be them. So, they could be contemplating about you. But I see right here, you're contemplating about them right here. Okay. Somebody may see right here that you really are inspiring right now or that you're healing now in some way right here. Okay. You might see that by yourself, that you are getting rest now. Okay. I feel like this weekend, you might get some rest for some people here. Okay. All right, let's see what else we have. Earth signs right here. Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. Ten of Wands right here. So Ten of Wands is a struggle. It's a burden in the past in some way. Maybe somebody overextended itself in the past. Okay, what's happening here, please? The Queen of Wands right here. Now, the Queen of Wands is somebody that's confident, they're really self-assured, and so is the King of Wands right here. This could be a couple right here. Maybe this is a couple in the past you're thinking about, or they're thinking about you. Okay. Maybe you had a business together. I feel like you really went into business together, I feel right here, for some people here. Because the King and the Queen of Wands could definitely be entrepreneurs or something like that. So maybe you went into business with somebody in the past, okay? I feel. Because somebody's definitely thinking about how it was in the past when you was, you know, together. Okay? I feel like you made money together in the past right here. Okay? Or somebody was really inspiring to each other or to somebody else here in the past, I feel. Wow, and then somebody started cheating and lying. Or somebody ran away or something like that, right? Okay. What's the message right here, please? The Six of Cups and the Ten of Wands. Yeah. The Strength card right here could be a Leo or Virgo. The Strength card is somebody here that is courageous very powerful they're definitely going to go for what they want in some way right here okay very courageous they'll take a chance at something right here okay look at that ten of swords right here okay and if somebody here is saying that something here is the end in some way it is because ten of swords could be an ending it could be insight it could be the end of a difficult time something like that right here so maybe somebody here does have insight about something here that happened in the past for some people right here. Somebody could have overextended themselves something that happened here in the past. 
Yeah, the death card. I feel like something here ended in the past. Death card right here. Something ended. Okay. Or it changed in the past. Somebody knows that. Something changed in the past. Could be a Scorpio. Right here. Right. Five of Wands right here. Some of you, there was some conflict that happened here in the past. Somebody knows it was. Somebody even could have insight right here. What happened to you in the past or something like that. Okay. Somebody might even feel like it's needless drama right here. Because you already have insight about what happened in the past. It could be something here about a death. You know about what happened with the death in the past. For some people right here. Yeah. Seven of Pentacles right here. Somebody's looking at this right here. They are. I feel like they go sit right here and look at this. How, you know, something here, you know, happened here in the past. I really feel like it's not the same as the past in some way. The past is not like how it was or something like that here. They realize that you're not the same. So it's needless drama trying to even get the past back in some way because somebody's not the same, I feel. Or somebody has insight about it or, you know, or maybe somebody here don't drink or they're not going to drink with them. Something like that. They're not going to, I feel, right here. Or it's going to take courage right here to drink with them or something like that. So they write about it. They even have anxiety about it, okay? Yeah. They could be curious about you. Somebody is, okay? But I feel like they have anxiety right here. They could be worried about something right here. How something here is definitely not the same as the past. Maybe you don't drink anymore or you're not going to drink with them. I feel like you're not. I feel like it's going to be a challenge to get you to drink with them or something like that. I get the sense for some people here. Okay. Now, this could be a relationship that you was in for some people here because... These two. Now, if it's not a relationship, it could be some type of um, project that you did with somebody right here. Or maybe it's a business that you did with somebody here in the past. Okay. Okay. Queen of Wands right here and the King of Wands. Queen of Wands right here and the King of Wands. Mm. Queen of Pentacles reverse. Yeah. I just feel like somebody either, okay, if this is a business partnership, somebody got greedy in the past. They did too much. So they did, right? The Queen of Pentacles reversed. Somebody doing anything for money and everything like that, you know? They even could have lost their wife in the past. Or maybe something here is a business deal. It's not a marriage, really. Or something like maybe it is a marriage on paper, but I feel like it's not. Or something like that. It's wishful thinking, I feel, right here, some type of way. It's something that's going to be the way that it was in the past, I feel. Right? Somebody even could have lost their wife in the past for some people right here when they was exploring other lovers in the past or something like that. Okay, and it even could have been the wife, so it could go either way, right? King of Wands right here and the um, Queen of Wands. Yeah, Ace of Swords right here. Okay, so somebody met new right here that somebody was exploring other lovers or somebody could have known right here that somebody here was doing anything for money. Or something like that. They was doing something like that. I just feel like it's just definitely not the same right here. Somebody does know they was doing all those things. Or they was exploring other lovers. Or something like that. You know, it's a cause and effect now. I'm getting right here. Because somebody is aware. Okay, about the money or the business. Or something like that. This could be a Virgo. But somebody's aware about that. Okay. So this could be somebody here that's famous. Maybe. Right, and this even could be somebody was having hope to be trustworthy, but I just feel like it's not the same anymore because somebody do know, you know, they was doing too much, I feel. The star right here in the page of pentacles, please. Yeah. Yeah, the clarity right here. Okay, they have clarity about a marriage. Yeah, they have clarity right here about a marriage right here for some people right here. Or about religion. They do. They have clarity about something like that, I feel. They have spiritual wisdom or knowledge. 
right here. Yeah, two of swords right here and a seven of wands right here. It's just going to be a for real big challenge right here to do something now, I feel. Yeah, it's a challenge right here. But maybe somebody's aware of their stalemate because of marriage. Or maybe somebody's aware right here about the Taurus. Okay, something like that. It's, they're aware. Somebody even could, it could be a challenge to get to somebody's money. It could be the case as well here because the Taurus knows or somebody knows, okay? Queen of Cups right here. It's, it's just a challenge right here with somebody be loving right here or stable or something like that right here with the Queen of Cups. Put some message right here, please. This even could be somebody wants to marry you, but I feel like maybe you don't want to get married or it's a challenge because of religion or something like that. Okay. The fool right here in the king of cups. Here's another thing I'm noticing too. There's a lot of people showing up here as well. Okay. It's starting to be too many people here. See? King and the queen of cups. There's some people here. All right. King and the Queen of Wands. There's some people here. All right. Then we got the Queen of Pentacles up here in reverse. That's another person here. So that's way too many people here. Who is all these people in the house? There's way too many people in this house. <laughs> way too many people in this house. Foolish to think right here. Okay. They could be, you know, the king of cups, caring or loving, or somebody will see them as caring and loving. When they're not open to something here in religion, or they're not open to something here in a marriage, or something like that. Or they thought they could hide a third party, or whoever all these people is, or whatever. Okay? They really thought they was going to get away with all this stuff. Maybe in the past they was, for some people here, because you got the past and a death card right here. So I feel like in the past they got away with some of these things for some people here. That's not going to work anymore, I feel Somebody has sent you. They've been awakened right here to all these things they was doing. Okay. Something like that right here. Four swords right here and the seven of swords. But what's somebody contemplate about it right here? You know. Somebody was lying. In some way. Well, somebody knows the truth. And sometimes the Knight of Swords I could even look at as an attack. So somebody even could have been attacking somebody right here. And they was able to get away with it in the past, I feel, in some way. This could be a love situation for some people here. Yeah. What's the message right here, please? Yeah. Maybe somebody was attacking their money. That's going to be so clear for somebody to see right now that they was attacking their money or they something like that they was doing because the King of Swords right here and the Knight of Swords, that's the truth. Those two together, that's the God's having truth. Somebody was cheating and lying here. They was. They had hidden this honor here in some way in a love situation. Two of Cups right here is love, okay? So in somebody's past right here in love, they was hurt for real. Well, somebody really did them dirty, I feel right here. For real. Six of Pentacles right here. Maybe it's financially. Somebody did. I'm still right here. Okay. That's revealed to somebody right here. Okay. That's revealed to somebody right here. Is it revealed to somebody right here that they could go to jail? Eight of Swords? Or it's revealed to somebody right here why you're all in your head about something or something like that? What's the Eight of Swords? truth is known they was attacking something here money or something they was doing they was attacking it that's the truth somebody's doing it i feel yeah okay it could be in a love situation i'm getting right here this is a love situation that's the truth right here somebody was cheating and lying in a love situation 
okay? Their power is right here. It's revealed for some people here, right? So they can't come over here and cheat and lie anymore because it's revealed. Now, for others right here, this could be a new love. They're seeing right here that you really went through something right here in the past. So if you know, somebody knows right here that you really, really went through something with an ex or something like that, that's revealed to somebody here, I feel. Yeah. Some of you right here, somebody's going, you know, they might walk away right here. Right? Right? That's one way it could be. Um, somebody may know right here there's a lot of pain right here. Okay? That needs to be dealt with in some way right here. So you can walk away from this energy. They realize it right here. And some of you, maybe somebody feel like it's too much that you went through. Could be the case. Three of Wands right here and Ten of Pentacles right here. Okay? But opportunity in the future right here in some type of way. Right? Yeah. Somebody's definitely consciously aware about something or somebody right here. Okay? Somebody may even walk away because you do know they was cheating and lying and they're worried about going to jail. Some people right here. They could be powerless and doing something right here. Okay? Yeah, because you believe in yourself, I feel. You're not going to give up right here. Something right here. Some secret or the fact that you're intuitive right here. Right? There even could be a secret investigation going on here for some people right here. Could be a cancer right here. Right? But something here is going to take structure, discipline, or something here that happened with the vehicle, somebody knows that. Or that's when some truth was here or something like that. I feel right here. This could even be, you know something right here. You're consciously aware, so I do feel like they're going to walk away with this one right here because you're consciously aware. Right here with this one. You're consciously aware about something. They could worry about going to jail. Or they're powerless at a magic spell. They realize that right now. So I'm just fate right here in a situation right here. In a love situation or being happy right here. It's a turning point. You're consciously aware, I feel. So somebody do know that. So they're going to walk away from a magic spell, I feel, for some people right here. Could be an Aries right here. A father or a boss. Mm -hmm. And I just feel like with this eight of wands right here, you're really, really thorough right here. How you're consciously aware about something here. Something here is like one point. How consciously aware you are about something right here. I feel like you're skilled. I'm getting right here. Okay. And this new cycle, you're skilled. <laughs> yeah. Either something here is a missed opportunity right here. Okay. With a third party lusting about, they know that it's a missed opportunity. Right. Or, yeah, it's a kind of feel. The world card. It's a new cycle right here. Yeah. You're going to get a new cycle. That's the truth right here. You do know they were cheating in line before. Something's not the same anymore. They know that right now, I feel. Okay, somebody does realize that. Let me give you a little bit right here for advice real quick. Okay, here. This is Earth, please. What is the advice? The devil card is reversed right here. Okay. The advice right here is that you don't have to deal with something that's toxic in some way. If something here is showing you what it is in some type of way. You know, I feel like, you know, um, what they say, a duck is a duck, right? It's not anything else. That's what it is in some way. You know, devil card reverse. Okay, I feel like you're not tempted right here about something or somebody right here, right? Yeah, I feel like somebody will be in regret right here about a foundation when it comes down to you. Somebody's focused upon a loss. And you know why? The advice right here is that you're not going to deal with right here. Somebody that's toxic or, or obsessed or something like that, I feel right here. I feel like you're leaving um, some bondage or addictions alone in some way, which kind of frees you here now, okay? The hermit card right here could be a Virgo right here. You figure somebody out. It's for you. Somebody, you know, they're going to be regretting you figure them out, okay? This even could be you. You could be focused upon this. Maybe it hurts a little bit that you figure them out. But figuring something out right here allows you to release the devil energy in some way. It could be a Capricorn or Virgo. But you release some addiction or being tempted by them or something like that. That's the advice, okay, that not being tempted by them. I think I'll end it right there, okay? This is going to take consistency and dedication, but you got this, all right? I send you all peace, blessings, love, and light. Namaste to you.